want with shoes. Oh, he thinks it makes him look more important. Oh, I think you'd better send him to me. We can't go on like this. We can't go squeaking through the afternoon like this. I wonder what made him buy shoes of all... Oh, here he comes. Good afternoon, Mr. Peregrine Esquire. I see you have some very beautiful shoes there. Yes, I like the rosettes, don't you? But I'm not so keen about the squeaking. He says that's the best part of them. Is that why you bought them? Makes it more important to squeak, you see. Well, I don't know, Peregrine. A song about squeaking shoes? It's the things I get asked for. All right, let's try. How about this? I do like shoes that squeak, that squeak, that squeak. Although they may be leaky, I much prefer them squeaky. Far off down the street, they hear me squeak. Everyone turns to look at me, wondering what that noise can be. I'm so important, you'll agree with my shoes. They're sweet. Oh, who ever heard of a peregrine penguin with shoes? Well, we can't go on like this. Something will have to be done. Now, uh, who knows something about shoes? I know. Muffin has a little friend staying with him from Czechoslovakia. His name is Kasparek, and he's a shoemaker. I shall ask him. Kasparek, come here a minute, will you? Hello, how are you? Say hello to everyone. Kasparek, have you heard Peregrine squeaking? What are we going to do about it? Oh, beeswax. Where do we get it? From Mr. B. I see. I wonder if he's outside the window, just a minute. Mr. B, are you there? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, I wonder if you happen to have a little beeswax handy, have you? Mm -hmm. It's all right. Could we have a little, please? Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you very much. I think he's just coming, Casper. Oh, here he comes. Come along, Mr. B. Good afternoon. Very polite, isn't he? Oh, that is your beeswax? Is that for us? Oh, yes. Beeswax for shoes. Special. Thank you very much. Goodbye. My kind regards to the Queen. Goodbye, Mr. B. Yes, now I think you'd better send Mr. Peregrine Esquire to me, please, Casperic. Now, the thing is, how to make Peregrine let me rub his shoes with beeswax? I know. I'll try and get him to go to sleep. I'll close the windows, make it all quiet. Oh, there he is. Oh, there you are, Peregrine. You know, I thought you were looking terribly tired just now. Oh, I did. I thought you were looking quite exhausted. Yes, you'll have to be careful. You've been walking about too much. No. Well, I think you ought to be careful just the same. Yes, I think you ought to lie down. I have a nice little rug here. Now, uh, yes. What about that, Peregrine? And the cushion here, too. Yes. Now, I think I should just lie down and have a little nap. You. What's that for you? No? Oh. Well, uh, perhaps as you're here, you'll just... Uh, Give me your opinion of a new song I'm writing. A lullaby. Uh, it goes like this, Peregrine. Good night. Close your eyes. Time to go to sleepy by. Good night. Peregrine. Very 
wide awake and rather annoyed, are you? Oh. He said it's a very silly, babyish song. Well, yes, it, it wasn't very good, was it, Peregrine? Uh, let's try the song with new words. About you. Yes, how's this go? Mm. Uh, I'm so sorry. Did I wake you up, Mr. Peregrine? Uh, yes, I was just admiring your beautiful shoes. Yes, they are nice, aren't they? They don't squeak anymore. Oh, how very strange, Peregrine. Oh, that is extraordinary. I'll walk about outside a little while. Perhaps they'll squeak in time, yes. Here a minute, I want to tell you something. Do you know that beeswax worked wonderfully well? There wasn't a squeak out of Peregrine Alfred, was there? No. Oh, I tell you something. Um, I'd rather like to hear you do that little song that you used to do in Czechoslovakia while you're here, wouldn't you? Yes, I wrote the English words. Do you remember? I'm Kasparek. Yes. It went like this. Let's try it. I am Kasparek, I'm a sturdy young Czech, and I come from Czechoslovakia. Yes, they all know me in my own country. I'm a star in Czechoslovakia, so I make my bow. And I don't know how I can tell you how nice I think you are. Nothing gave me a welcome. See how Peregrine's getting on, will you? Here's Peter the pup in the usual hurry. What is it? Oh, Peter. He says he doesn't like it now. Peregrine doesn't squeak anymore. Why don't you? He creeps up behind you and catches you out. Well, what were you doing? Rinsing a bone in Peregrine's bath water. Well, what can you expect, Peter? Well, now, now, be more careful in future. Yes, go on up, get away quickly. Rinsing a bone in bath water. Oh, Muffin. Oh, he's got the shoes. Muffin, Ulika, however did you get them? Oh, Peregrine's having a bath. Oh, I see. Everybody's complaining because he creeps about and catches them out. You want them to squeak again, oh, Muffin, after all this trouble. Ask Mr. B. All right. Mr. B. Mm -hmm. I'm terribly sorry, but we want to make the shoes squeak again. Mm -hmm. Yes, he's rather annoyed. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Put them on the window ledge in the sun and they'll, they'll start squeaking again. Upside down. There you are, Muffin. Oh, hello, Oswald the Ostrich. <laughs> Having a good time? That's right. Now then, I wonder how long it will take for those shoes to start squeaking, because Peregrine will finish his bath at any minute. What's that? What's 
that muffin? Well, I put the shoes out there and they're squeaking out there. Go and see what it is. Go. I can't understand it. Oh, look who's coming. Oswald. Why are you squeaking, Oswald? Oh, are you thinking what I'm thinking? They're gone. Oswald, you've eaten peregrine shoes. Oh, what am I going to do? You ought to be ashamed of yourself, Oswald. No, it's nothing to laugh at. Go away and hide and don't let Peregrine hear you squeak, for goodness sake. What am I going to do about Peregrine? Oh, and he's coming. Oh, there's going to be such trouble. <laughs> Hello, Peregrine. Had a nice bath? Yes, I know. Somebody's taking his shoes. Um, listen, Peregrine, I want to have a word with you about your feet. Just tell me, you have such exquisitely beautiful feet. Why do you bother to wear shoes? He wants to whisper. He says he's never seen his feet. I see. Of course, you can't see over your chest. Yes, I understand. Would you like me to describe them to you? Well, uh, they're very beautiful. They're sort of greeny beige pedigree. Yes, they're slightly webbed. Yes. Uh, they have three toes, and uh, they are beautifully kept. Oh, very clean. Yes. Now, you know, if I were you, if I had feet like that, I should show them all the time. I should never wear shoes at all. Never. Oh, I shouldn't dream of wearing shoes. You can be very proud of those feet. Oh, very proud, Peregrine. Yes, marvelous feet, I should call those. Oh, that settles that. Now, Muffet, come here. I've settled Peregrine. Now, what about Oswald? Casperic has given Oswald some beeswax to eat so he doesn't squeak anymore. So all we have to do, Muffin, is to say goodbye, everyone, and give me a kiss. That's right. Goodbye till next time. <laughs>